Hi guys! So today's video is going to be a what's in my bag video. My first one and I'm excited to share with you guys what I carry in my bag. I know I love watching these type of videos because of course I'm a nosy person. The bag that I'm going to be showing you is this bag here. It's from Anne Klein and I bought it at TJ Maxx. It's pretty large and it has this cute little lion logo here. It has Anne Klein here and in the back it has this perfect little pocket here which I use for my phone. So now let's get into the actual contents of this bag. So here's the inside of the bag. As you can see, it has this super cute lining and it has two pockets here and another pocket here, which I use for anything that might be important, such as notes or receipts, anything like that will go here. Perhaps the most important item in anyone's bag is of course their wallet. And mine is from Kenneth Cole. And this wallet is so roomy, you can fit anything in here. I even have my checkbook, yes, I still use checks, along with my store cards, loyalty cards, credit cards. And on this side, which is pretty cool, you have a mirror here, and over here you have another slot for a card. I like to keep my Sally's Beauty card here. This cute little bag here is my coin bag slash kind of sort of miscellaneous bag. I have my USB in here. Um, a token for good luck, some loose cash, and surprisingly, a roach to play pranks on people. This here is something that I bought a super, super, super long time ago when I first started college. And I just like to keep pens, markers, pencils, anything like that in here. I've had way too many pens pop in my purse and now I know better. I keep them always in something like this. This here is my DIY Max Fix Plus. I use this to refresh throughout the day, especially in the winter when my face can start to look dry. I'll just spritz a bunch of this on my face and look refreshed. This here is a Pacifica Roll-On Perfume and this is in the scent Indian Coconut Nectar. And I bought this at Ulta and I think it smells absolutely amazing. And I like to put it on anytime, all the time, whenever I feel like smelling like Indian Coconut Nectar. This here is a little outdated. I know they have smaller ones, but this is the first one that I bought. And this, if you guys don't know, is a hook for your purse. I've been to one too many restaurants where I didn't know what to do with my purse, so I purchased this. And if you don't know how it works, the idea is that you place it on the table like this, and you just hang your purse so you don't have to worry about it falling on the ground or being taken or being kicked around and it has like this rubber felt here that prevents it from slipping off of the table. I have my tissue and this cute little notepad for anything, any kind of note that I want to write down or if there's some groceries I need to buy, I just jot it down in here and take it with me. This here is a lotion from Bath & Body Works and it's in the scent Winter Cranberry. I don't know if they have this scent anymore. I bought this last year and I like to just buy ahead of time and throw it in the drawer for whenever I finish. So yeah, hand cream. And now the second most important item for me in my bag is my phone. And lastly we have my makeup bag. The actual bag is from Ipsy and it's this silvery metallic color with these cute little buttons or bees, whatever you call them. And don't be alarmed, but this is what it looks like inside. There's a bunch of stuff in here. And um, yeah, let's break it down. So this thing here is actually a sewing kit that I found at Michael's. And it opens up to reveal a few buttons, a safety pin, a sewing needle, some thread, and buttons. So this is perfect. There have been times when things have broken and I've needed something like this and didn't have it. So now I always, always, always carry this. Some Claritin because my body is just crazy and sometimes it likes to break out in hives for absolutely no reason. So I always carry some type of antihistamine. Pure Roll hand sanitizer, especially with all the stuff that's going on lately, you need to have one of these in your bag if you don't. And I just have the regular Pure Roll hand sanitizer. I have a hair tie, headband, and a bunch of bobby pins in my bag for those moments when I want to switch up my hairstyle. 
And this here is a travel container. Inside I have my hair serum, which I think is the Icy Polishing Serum. And I use it all the time whenever my hair gets frizzy or too dry or anything like that. I just apply this. Some bandages. Here I have some cherry chapstick. Here I have some cuticle oil, especially not for the winter months. For me, this is a must along with my hand lotion. It really moisturizes the skin around my cuticles, so always have this in my bag. I have this nail filer from La Crosse, and it's super cute because it comes in this container, so you don't have to worry about anything getting around in your purse. And it just looks like that. A black pencil for me is a must, and this one is from Urban Decay. It's a 24-7 velvet, black velvet pencil. I got this in my Ipsy bag, and it's pretty, pretty, pretty dark. I mean, look at that. I keep this in my purse at all times. This here is an eyeliner from Avon, and I don't use it for my eyes. I actually use it for my eyebrows. It's a dark brown color, and whenever my powder kind of strays away from my eyebrows, I just go and touch it up with this pencil here. I also carry this concealer from MAC and it's the Studio Finish Concealer in NC42. For me, this is a must throughout the day. My concealer starts to fade out and it's the best for blemishes and dark marks. So this is always, always in my bag. Here I have a mini Victoria's Secret Light FX Eye Brightener and I don't use it for my eyes, I like to use it around my cheeks just to highlight and give myself that more dewy look. And last but not least, I have my favorite lipstick of all time. This is Max Taupe. It's a matte lipstick and it's a nudie color for my skin tone and it's, it's just the best. I've gone through so many tubes of this and it's always in my purse because I can leave my house with a bright pink lip but I'll probably come back home wearing this color. It's just it's my favorite of all time. So that's everything that I have in my bag. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can keep watching these type of videos. And let me know down below if you're carrying something that I'm already carrying in your bag or if there's something that maybe I should consider carrying my bag. And if you have any suggestions for future videos, please leave that down below. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.